hey guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here make sure you subscribe and turn post notifications on so you don't miss out on any of my videos and i'd really appreciate if you um comment some video um suggestions in the comments below because it's really hard to come up with like video ideas and yeah um so I think it was like last year yeah last year um sometime i started this series this like aesthetic series where i do a different aesthetic um for each video so i did like goth e-girl i think um and i haven't done that in a while so i thought i would um do that again so for this aesthetic in this video i'm going to be doing a body aesthetic so like, yeah, so the first thing I'm going to do is my makeup, but before I do that, I'm going to put my little like headband thing that I just, that like gets my, my um, hair out of my face. Um, yeah. So I've done that and now I'm just going to put my moisturiser on. So this is the moisturiser I use, my Nivea Soft one, which I've still got quite a lot left in it. So I'm just going to do this. Oh and I'd really appreciate if you um, comment below any like aesthetic like different like different aesthetics for me to do so i've done like goth i've done e-girl i think i've done soft girl um and in this video i'm doing um a body aesthetic so i'd really appreciate if you put any um different aesthetics in the comments so we're just rubbing this my moisturizer in So, um, I'm, and before I do my makeup, I'm just going to put this Vanilla Rose Scented Lip Balm, which I got for Christmas. So just go uh, and do that and so I can see my lips are nice and moisturised. Okay. So, um, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to brush on my eyebrows and then I'm going to, um, like, go around them with concealer because I've decided that I'm not going to, um, like, fill in my eyebrows because my eyebrows are naturally, like, quite, like, thick and, like, dark, so I don't really need to fill them in, but... I just um, but I do um, go around them with concealer. So I'm gonna, so I'm gonna be using my Last Imperfection concealer in the shade Fair, which I always use. Okay. The brush I use um, is in this. Um, is this one. It's just a. Uh, brush that I use, that, um, a small brush that I use um, for going my eyebrows with. So I just like um, put a bit on my on the brush, and then I just go around my eyebrows. So yeah, just like this. Okay, so I've just um, 
gone around my eyebrows and I have also concealed like over like on my eyelids so they're ready to put eyeshadow on which is the neck which I'm gonna do next um so like because uh, I'm doing like baggy aesthetic um I looked up on Google like um baddie aesthetic aesthetic baddy um makeup and it came up with like hey and it came up with people with like bright eyeshadow so like so like some of them had like pink and like some like oranges like orange eyeshadow and then some did have brown but I think I'm gonna I, I don't know which one to do like pink or orange I'm not really sure which one do you think would look I think I'm gonna do orange I think so I'm gonna do use three different shades so I'm gonna use this one right there then that one and then I'm gonna use this a little bit of this red as well um so yeah i'm gonna start with the lightest shade which is that one so and i'm just gonna use i'm gonna get all my brushes out my eyeshadow brushes out so i think i'm gonna use this brush to start with this yeah and i had done like a makeup look before like, mate, I think it was like last week or something. I don't know. And it's still got a bit of blue on, it, so I'm just gonna just like rub it off, rub it off with my onto my hand, so I don't get like blue on my eyes because I'm doing an, an orange eyeshadow look. Okay, so I'm just gonna dip into that lightest shade, which is that one. Okay, and I'm just gonna. Tap it off a bit, tap, 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 tap. Okay, and then I'm just gonna, I think I'm just gonna put it all over my eye at first. So I've just put the lightest orange on my eyes and I think I'm just gonna use this to blend the lightest orange out a little bit. Um just a little bit. Like I don't want to blend it out too much, but so I'm just gonna get a little bit on my a little bit of that orange on my brush. Um and then just not remember not too much. I'm not doing it blend out too much. Cause I still wanna put like the dark oranges on as well. Yeah, it didn't really make a difference but you know. And now I'm just going to put on this orange now, this one. Um yeah. So I'm just gonna put that in my crease. And I'm gonna tap it off. Tap, tap, tap. Okay. Okay, I'll do it. Let's do that. Okay, so I put the darker eyeshadow on in my crease and now i'm just going to go in with the the red um and just like put it in this this my crease again but i'm not gonna put too much because i don't want it to like look like it's a red a red eyeshadow look i want it to be orange so i'm just gonna put a little bit You're probably not going to notice it really, but oh well. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, so I have done, I can't really see it. Um, the, yeah. I've done the, put like the red on and it's made it look a little, I don't know how to explain it. It's just like, just look better, I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, I'm gonna cut my crease but I'm just gonna go up to like the middle of my eyelid. So yeah. All right, so I've cut my crease and now I'm going to be putting on um, like a glitter eyeshadow. So I'm gonna use that one in that glitter instead in this palette so i'm just going to i think i'm just going to use my finger to just like put it on so oh that is that is so pretty that is so pretty oh my god i haven't actually used this this um like bronzy colored glitter eyeshadow before so this is the first time using it wow beautiful okay so I've put the glitter on in it I think it looks really good like Um, so now I'm just going to like clean it up here so um, I'm just gonna use a wipe I'm just gonna I'll be back in a sec I just need to get some more okay so I've got I'm um, back <coughs> I'll just take up. Um, and I've got the wipes um, yeah so I'm just gonna just gonna clean it up with a wipe so I'm just gonna do that and just like I think it's very effective when you do it that way because it just makes it look sharp like the eyeshadow looks sharper and better so yeah um but before I move on I'm gonna um use like um the darker orange to go under um under like on that bit of my eye there is it called your waterline or i think it's called waterline i don't know but anyways so can you see it can you even see it i don't know you can't even see it but anyway i'm just gonna So I've just gone underneath my eye, um, like added like the dark orange and the red, um, and I think that's good. I don't know if it's add eyeliner. I think I might add like a little bit, like a smudged look. So I'm just gonna quickly do that. I hope it don't mess up. Cause it, because I really like this eye shadow look and I just don't want to mess it up. Yeah. Okay, so it's not much, can't really tell on camera, but I can tell, I can, I can uh, see it in the mirror, but I think it just makes it look a bit better, you know? So now um, I'm gonna move on to my foundation and like and like my concealer and everything like powder and bronzer and yeah. So I'm just gonna um, cut like get back to you once I've done my like face makeup. Um, 
but first I'm just because um you've already you've seen like my makeup routine like in every like every makeup video so yeah so I'll just use, use this like my normal fit me Maybelline New York matte poreless foundation so I'm just gonna get back to you when I've done my like the rest of my makeup okay so um i've done my makeup so this is this is it um i have got my orange eyeshadow um with a little bit of red in it you probably can't tell because it was only a little bit but it just made it a little darker um and i've got also got um <clears throat> sorry about that um also got um black eyeliner and then i've got on my lips i've got clear lip gloss so yeah so now i'm just gonna do my hair and i'm gonna put it in a bun um because when i searched aesthetic body hairstyles it came up with like images of girls in with a bun hairstyle so i'm just so that's what i'm gonna do um and i'm also gonna get into my outfit so i'm wearing mom jeans with a like a crop top that has like some writing on it you'll see when i've got it on and i've also got a belt that's got like a chain on it um so yeah so i'll get back to you when i've got the outfit on okay so this is the finished look so i've got my makeup and then my hair in a bun and then my outfit which is super cute i love this outfit i got this um i think i got the i think it was the day before, yes, it was either yesterday or the day before. I got this in the mail um, from Sheen, and it's cute, so cute. So these, um, I got these mom jeans on that I've got a, quite a few rips in them, which are so cute. And then I got this top, which is super cute. It says California on it, and it's just like a super cute cropped t-shirt. Um, and then I've got this belt, which is like. I love and it's got this like chain on it so and I'd probably wear if I was going out like this I'd probably wear um my black air forces my black air force ones so yeah so that is it for the video make sure you subscribe and turn post notifications on so you don't miss out on any of my videos and um can you put in the comments below any suggestions of like videos that I could do um and um like diff like and can you comment like any uh different aesthetics that i could do as well so yeah bye